Season 1, Episode 9. Yeah, my voice is all messed up. First thing, <laughs> Jesus. I, try, I tried to wait until it was reasonable, so sorry, guys. What the? These aren't my clothes. It would be pretty weird. First Goku family sword use. Is that the Phoenix, like on top of Fort Condor? Spoilers. What is happening right now? There was an introductory sequence. Do, to get a burger around here? Do you say burger? Oh, we get like an Indiana Jones kind of sojourn here. Kind of like him with a sword. It makes him distinctive. Interesting. My name is Gohan. I got him like Dusty. He's all Dusty. But there's no way out. Except for that trail right behind me. What? Nice. <laughs> all right, that was a nice little <laughs> encounter. I said I can't make it down from way up here. That's not my problem. Get out of here all by myself. I can't. Oh man. Say Goku? I mean Gohan. Gohan. What's his name? You can't see. Your eyes are turned off. <laughs> I'll fix them. That's better. Why you meddlesome little? Couldn't you? They got an echo in the sound too, with the voices and everything. Yeah, he's he's way too coddled. That's Chi Chi's fault. Maybe Goku's too. But good example of a character that has its own interests that aren't dependent upon the protagonist. Yeah, he's whiny and annoying, but they do have to show his progression. They also have snakes and bats and spiders now. Stop being such a baby. <laughs> <laughs> do you have anything to eat? Oh yes, being a robot, I always keep plenty of food flying around. <laughs> what do you think? <laughs> Not good to indulge that kind of behavior. Look what I found! Right where you said they'd be! Aren't you a Capsule Corp robot? Yeah, I recognize some of your markings now. Oh, appeal to his vanity. Sorry. Uh, uh, it's just not moms. <laughs> but you're the first person I've seen in 30 years. Oh. Uh. I'm gonna get you out of here. Stop that. Jump out of here on my own without anyone's help. Wait, you're causing your cave ah. Oh, out of here. I can't hold this thing forever. Uh -huh. But you No. You must leave. What are you waiting for? Do it. Now. Do it. Go on, what are you doing? Oh no! <laughs> I knew he was gonna do that. Oh my god! <laughs> Isn't that Rami Malik? Oh, Gohan getting some life lessons lessons hard here. I'm here. I thought you left me. Come now, Gohan. That won't do any good. Come on, wake up! Please don't leave me. I don't know if I can make it on my own out here, but I'll try. There it is. Alright, I really like that episode, so we haven't had a whole lot going on, you know, so far. There has been a good chunk of filler, but that one was, it was serendipitous without being contrived. You know, it's not like they set up any of the stuff related to the robot ahead of time. Like, did you hear about this cave? It has some hieroglyphs, and there was this robot one time, you know, nothing like that. It's just something you ran into. It was unique. They didn't have enough time, really, for one episode to uh, flesh out a kind of relationship with the robot, but they, they did 
enough and it's something that's memorable it's a memorable cute little thing i like that a lot they kind of overdid it with the robots dying words at the end you know that was a little that was a little hokey i wish they would have left that out but other than that uh, you know i think everything about that pretty much worked it made sense to gohan's character it, it, it had actual costs for him acting within character so that he has to learn how to be you know better so a lot of good things about it all right next one